Good afternoon, everybody. We're very excited to have <coughs> two players of the oud, which is an instrument that you will find across the Middle East, in Turkey and in Greece. Um, and on the on my far right is a third generation player, Armenian oud player, Mal Barskamian, who's also give him a hand. He's also um, a multi-instrumentalist. So not only is he an oud player, he's a clarinetist. He began as a, was it four years old, at your grandpa's picnic, playing the dumbek, the rhythm instrument, and he's also a guitar player, and a mentor, and a teacher. And part of today's concert is to talk about, musically, the handing on of repertoires and ways of playing that are passed on musician to musician. And so joining Mel on stage is Dateb Gavorkian. He's got a lot of fans out there. The Oud, generally, I asked about this, generally, um, it would, you wouldn't normally see, unless you were at a picnic or at a restaurant and in a jam session, you wouldn't see several Oud players playing together. They would be playing with other instruments. But we thought it would be really nice to feature the Oud um, and to feature this younger person who is taking up this tradition and ensuring that it stays alive and vital. So please make welcome Mal Barsamian and Datev Gavorkian. Thank you, Maggie. Thank you very, very much. It is a pleasure to be back here at the Lowell Folk Festival, festival after a two-year hiatus. Um, I didn't want to have just an Armenian band performing here at the festival. I wanted to feature a specific instrument, which is, is the oud, and also to feature former student Datev Gavorkian, but also to carry on the tradition, in which hopefully Datev will be able to do as he gets older uh, for the next generation and pass along the traditions of traditional Armenian music that was brought here by our grandparents. Uh, what we're going to do first of all is we're going to play a piece called Nehevant Wanga, which was made popular by the blind Udis Uri Harant, who came here from Istanbul, an Armenian, and uh, he was like the godfather of the Udin, which many Armenian Ud players emulated and uh, tried to mimic and try to copy and uh, learned his repertoire. So we're going to play that for you right now.
next song I'll be performing is um, called Sari Sirun Yaru, which in Armenian means um, my mountain beauty. So.
um, this next piece is um, called the Lazbar, which is, um, you know, my grandfather actually comes from the village of Shabinkara Hisa. This is um, like a, almost like the, uh, the village's song, as you can say. Lazbar is like the, um, the song of the people of the Laz. So, perform. And it's in a 7 8 rhythm, so it's, uh, it's a little bit funky, but uh, yeah, you guys are here in a minute.
This particular piece is called Lake Savannah. Yeah. It's basically a fisherman dance piece. Uh, it's in the meter of 5-4. 1-2, 1-2, 3, 1-2, 1-2, 3. 